Philip Mann, uh, music director is my title of the Arkansas Symphony Orchestra, and I'm just completing my second season. As music director, I'm in charge of the artistic side of the orchestra, so that means picking the music that we play, selecting the guest artists that will come through town, but perhaps the most visible uh, duty with my job is seeing me stand in front of the orchestra and conduct the orchestra on Saturday nights, Sunday afternoons, on any uh, range of performances that we give. That's it. That's a big, that's an explosion. I really see my role at the Arkansas Symphony is serving a much broader community. It's more serving the state and embracing this aspirational posture where we're all trying to move forward. And I happen to have this great art form that I get to share with my colleagues at the symphony and work in that, really feeling like we are driving the state forward by allowing people to do these things. Because I think the perfect job, if you were to construct it in a laboratory, might be orchestra conductor. As a conductor, I literally feel responsible not just for the artistic growth of our musicians, but literally to cultivate and move forward the relationship of our community with music. Orchestras are very special. We're one of the last places where you can really go to a place and talk about the big questions. Love, death, capital T, truth, that kind of stuff. That's becoming more and more rare. And that's why I think the future of our art form is very bright, because we're, the, what makes us special is becoming more and more special in our, our contemporary society. And I feel like our audiences are warm enough that it creates a setting and a surrounding where people really can put themselves out there. And in the arts, that's when something spontaneous happens. That's when something very special can happen. So when you see the, the risk taking and people really going for it on stage, it's really, it really is, that, that is the feeling that we get. That really is what's happening. And we couldn't do that without this great warm support from Arkansas audiences.